Hey guys, MC Stu here with TweakFreak.net. Um, do a quick video on uh, getting the Star Trek mod loaded on Homeworld Remastered. So I ran across it somehow on accident and so started digging in, looking through the forums, and uh, was unable to figure out how to mod a uh, Steam uh, driven game, I guess. Um, so I uh, did some research and figured out that there's actually ways to mod uh, Steam games uh, all legit through the, uh, the Steam platform. Uh, so there's something called, uh, and some of you guys may already know this, I was unaware, but uh, Steam Workshop. And uh, there's tons of mods for tons of different games and basically you find uh, you know, the game you want or a particular uh, quote unquote mod, you click on subscribe and at least in the case of the home world, um, game, once you subscribe, it just downloads and it just integrates it in when, when you launch, which I'll show you. Um, so it was, it was kind of weird at first. I um, subscribed to it and you know I went to launch the game in my library and uh, I didn't know what to do. Um, there wasn't anything that said mod or launch or any of that. So anyways, after figuring it out, I, I couldn't find any videos or anything like that on it. So I figured I'd just throw one together real quick. Uh, like, subscribe uh, if it was helpful. Um, let me know if you have any uh, comments, questions, um, or anything else uh, we can try and figure out together here. Um, so what I found is if we go to, uh, on your client, you can do this online too, but um, you know, it'll obviously download it to your clients if you do it online. Um, so if we go to, let's see here, community and workshop, and again, I'm going to show you the, uh, the Star Trek mod. I've actually already installed it. So uh, there was also a Star Wars Star Wars one I wanted to try. So uh, we'll, we'll try that. So uh, Homeworld, Homeworld Remastered Collection. And uh, so this one, I mean, there's, there's tons of them on some of these here. Uh, there's another one I'm going to check out later. Is it here? There is a, a Battlestar Galactica one. So click on Most Popular. Star Wars is at the top of the list. Um, there's just a ton of stuff. Some of these that you know, I'm not sure. So I did this one here, uh, which is the uh, Star Trek Continuum. Uh, I think they did it for like the 50th anniversary or something like that. Uh, in any case, this one, um, so you just click on it to subscribe to it, and uh, it, it'll download it. So I already have that subscribed. I don't know why that's not checked since I'm in my client and logged in, but let's, uh, let's try the Star Wars one here. Uh, it's popular. Click on this guy. So subscribe. And so in some cases you'll have to restart the client. Um, I'm just going to leave this as is and we'll, we'll go to the library. So all I did for the Star Trek one is I clicked on, clicked on the sub subscribe. Um, and it uh, when I switched over to my game library here. Uh, so we got Homeworld selected and I'm just going to click on play. And okay, so here we go. So it added this button here. So if you have Homeworld Remastered, you can play the original, the second, and then there's the remastered version of it. Uh, so it added the mod button here. So if we click on that, um, so it looks like it's still downloading the Star Wars one that, uh, that we just clicked on. Um, but Star Trek Continuum is here. So you select that, it shows up in the middle, and then click Select, and it'll move it over to this other side here. Then all you do is launch it. When I do that, it's going to go full screen. It's probably not going to see everything. Um, we'll see if I can adjust it, but I don't think so once I'm recording here. Uh, but in any case, this game is its a great game already. Um, the mod, they, they really did a good job. The ships are great. They changed the music, voices. Um, I mean, it's excellent. I mean, you can even separate the saucer section on the Enterprise. The Prometheus break into three pieces. They really did an excellent, excellent job. If you're a Star Trek fan, uh, you'll just love this. The, uh, the home world platform is awesome. Um, that three-dimensional playing field, uh, you, you really just can't beat it. Um, so I'll, I'll do another video uh, showing uh, the, the actual game off itself um, so you guys can check that out. But again, um, you know, if this was helpful, I hope it was. Uh, subscribe, like, uh, appreciate it. Um, so I'll go ahead and launch it here and we'll just, uh, like I said, you probably won't be able to see most of it. So you can see a part of it there. Get the steam out of the way. So it launches. You go in, and basically the uh, you know the whole setup's just like it normally would be on Homeworld. So again, like, subscribe. Have a good one, guys.